hi guys welcome to my channel happy Sunday so today we are going to look at how I style my triplets from summer to fall let's do this as you guys know on this channel sustainability matters and we find sustainability very sexy so here is triplet number one and we are focusing today on the pants i discovered that i have three of these pieces in my closet yes they are in different colors but they are the triplets that we'll be focusing on today unfortunately these pants it's a hundred percent polyester and you could see it you could feel it you could yeah it is polyester at its finest what i love about it though is the print and it's the reason why i gravitated towards this pants when i wasn't even paying attention to fabric or even anything else but fit and style so that's why it's in my closet today but yeah as you guys know polyester and i we don't get along very well i am trying to get it out of the fashion industry so yeah here are some of the facts about polyester items So this is my summer look so I chose to pair it with this top this top is very familiar to you guys I have it in several colors that's the information and this is how I style this triplet in the fall I am wearing this waistcoat waistcoat is a trend it has been a trend for a long time but not many people really paid attention to it but i love waistcoats i've had waistcoats in my closet for years i grew up on waistcoats so <laughs> yeah so i've decided to style it with this particular piece today because i think it's definitely a fall color it's velvet material and i just love the way that it looks i love the style of it i love the western look of it so i think it pairs beautifully here number two it's this gorgeous uh, print I love the print of this one in fact it pairs so beautifully with this linen top that I just got into my closet so it's definitely complimentary to it you guys know I have a love love relationship with linen it's one of the most sustainable fabrics ever and here are some of the reasons why i just love linen and i would invest in it anytime any day anywhere any place and i would wear it all year round because it is an all year round fabric i love the color the style and the fabric this top click all three boxes and the color palette is also within the print of this pants so i find that i just love this look
this is how I followerize it. By the way, guys, followerize is not a word. It's my word for this channel. So yeah, I've decided to followerize it with this jacket. This is a no-brainer. This is not anything creative in any way at all. It's just convenient pairing. And I love this jacket. This jacket was given to me by a friend of mine. And ah, oh, it's 100% wool. It shows. It's just absolutely fabulous. But here's some tips I want you to keep in mind when you're considering buying items made from wool. So there you have it. How beautiful is wool as long as you're being ethical about it. The second fall option to followerize this outfit is to wear a long cardigan and I love a very long cardigan all the way to the floor if I could find that unfortunately sometimes I can't but guys this is a great option and the cardigan feels like cotton and elastin but I have some tips for you on how you could deal with fabrics made of mixed fibers. Sorry to interrupt guys, but just a quick note. Hi guys! If you just so happen to just click on my video, you are new, please click the red subscribe button. So here they are guys, if you click on these buttons, you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when I post new videos. And most importantly, guys, it's free. Thank you so much for subscribing. Love ya. Let's get back to the video. Triplet number three. This piece was actually the piece that triggered all the other triplets. And I saw this piece on one of the sales girls and oh my god did she look good so i thought i'll go and try it only to discover that they have it in many different colors so here we are today but guys don't do like me here are some sustainable tips on how you could be imperfectly sustainable because that's all we need right now every little tip goes a long way to being more sustainable in early fall i have two options and this is the first option it's this long line jacket that i've had forever in my closet and i doubt it's gonna be going anywhere because it's it's just a staple Unfortunately, of course, it's polyester, but you guys know how to deal with polyester. Don't buy it anymore. <laughs> so I'm pairing it with this bag. This bag is 100% leather, like the first clutch that you saw. So because like me, I know many people love leather. Here are some sustainable tips to consider when you're thinking of buying leather items and i often try to keep them in mind i'm not perfect but i do keep them in mind and while we are at it here are some natural fibers that you could consider investing in in the future so again for this item i am using the same jacket i paired it with previously because I love it it's a great piece to just throw over your shoulder when you're meeting up with your 10 best friends for the fall and absolutely a no-brainer there's nothing creative here about it it's just convenience the bag is like the other piece it's 
100% leather you guys know what to consider when it comes to leather I love this clutch it's a great Bottega Veneta dupe so I absolutely love it I pair it with almost everything it's a great color so I love that ah love this piece and here is another option that you could also consider for fallerizing this particular piece and it's an unusual way of fallerizing it in the sense that the color combo is a bit off but that's how I like it that's how I love to be a little bit creative in my pairings I don't like to pair things that you expect me to pair it with this piece is a blend of wool and polyester you guys know what to do already but if you think you would be cold definitely throw over a scarf and you're good to go i hope you have learned something i hope you enjoyed thanks for watching and i'll see you soon